so now you can see like here there are certain syntax about uh, dot lib and we will discuss all these things uh, later on so this is my design and 2x1 so this is uh, the portion about the and end cell so this is a and cell now in the dot lib you can see like for the and cell it's you know, going to give you a definition like and then there are for this end there are two input one output so the pin syntax is here pin a pin b and the pin y so the input pin is a b and how you will come to know from this definition there's a option of direction so within the end there is a pin syntax pin a pin b pin y within every pin section so you can see the open bracket and the close brackets so there is a direction so now this direction if it is an input input and output you can see a is input b is input y is out now input there are other parameters also we will discuss those parameters later on but let's let's talk about the pin y so the pin y direction is output now I was talking about in terms of there is a relationship between a Y and input pin. So you can see like here, what type of relationship I'm talking about. It's a timing relationship. So there is a, there is a section. It's a timing section. So it's an open bracket. And similarly, if you will go down, there will be a closed bracket. So within this section, let's talk about the timing relationship with respect to Two input pin so the those two input pin was one is the a one is a b so let's talk one by one that means the related pin so related pin is a so now within this timing section i'm talking with respect to a related to the pin a so this is a pin a so remember this whole thing is within the y so within the y timing related pin is a and timing sense so this is the syntax timing sense and here you can see it's a positive unit and in a combinational logic if you remember for the and gate the relationship between a and y the input and output that is a positive unit and that is the part of this positive unit now when it comes to the delay information we will discuss that thing after this like uh, how the delay is going to calculate but if you remember I mentioned like there are uh, rising and the falling why the rising and the falling is uh, important then you can see like everywhere it is written cell rise rise transition you will go down then is a fall cell fall fall transition what are what all these uh, uh, cell rise cell transition we will discuss that thing uh, in a uh, in a delay portion till this particular part like uh, whatever i have discussed till now now after this then again there is a timing section related pin b so that means there are two input pin one is a one is b and there's the output and you can see within this dot lip you will get every information within the y y with respect to a y with respect to b and once this is done it is done then it is a internal power section power section is there that is okay that is a different and uh, once the power section is done you can see now there is another cell so in the dot lib you can see there are two type of information one is uh, the internal power and timing information and those uh, whatever the power or uh, uh, timing information that is with respect to the y output with respect to input pins Related to A and a B. So same you can see here also and 2x2. I think same you can see like pin A, pin B, pin Y. In a pin Y again there is a timing related pin A. And if you will go down related pin B. Let's take another cell. This is a AOI cell. This is one of the best examples. Now in a AOI how you will come to know how many input pins are there. So if you will go in the definition of AOI for this particular cell, for the rest of the thing, this is the AOI 21X1. Now what is that? There is a pin A, there is a pin B, there is a pin C, okay, there is a pin Y. Now A is a direction. It is an input, B is also input, C is also input. So you can see there are three input pin and there is a one output pin. 
So whatever we have discussed in the AOI, that is input and output, that means there should be three timing arc, AY, BY and the CY. Now AY, let's see like whether these three was going to be there. And if you remember in a AOI, we have, we have mentioned, uh, discussed like it's going to be a negative unit. So A, I, A, 2Y, B, 2Y and the C, 2Y, it should be negative. Let's see, like within the pin Y, there is a uh, timing. Now within timing, there is a related pin, which is A. Now this A is a negative unit. Now similarly, if you will go down for this, let's, let's see like where this bracket is going. This is the red one and this bracket is closing here then there is another section is the timing here it is a related pin b and again it is a negative unit let's see where this timing section is going to be closed this timing section is going to be closed here there is a third timing section and this third timing section is related to c timing sense is a negative unit now if you will see where this timing section is going to close Go down and you see here internal power came where this is going to close both A, B and C. And there are three sections which is related to the internal power. And once this is done, you can see everything is done. This is a buffer. There are only two pins, pin A and the pin Y. Direction is input, the direction is output. For the Y, it is the output. Now within the timing section, there is only one timing section that is related pin A and this is a positive unit because it's a buffer. Now if you will see like how many timing sections are there, only one timing section is going to be there. Then the internal power section and this is done. Everything is done. Like our uh, Facebook page, YouTube channel for more such updates. Thank you for watching. Be expert, buy expert, best of luck.